Hello, Bobcats. Brad Schreffler here. Just checking in about grade sync. So as Bridgewater knows, we now have the auto sync and everyone else is still doing the manual sync. But one of the things that it's really important you do, especially with, with report cards coming up, is to make sure the sync has worked. And I don't know that everybody knows how to do this, so I just want to walk you through the steps and what some of the common errors are. So first of all, go into one of your courses and you'll want to do this for any course sections you have available. And you're going to actually look for the icon that says grade sync. This is going to be your status. So this is going to tell you if your syncs worked. If you have actually done a sync manually, you can always go straight here and check on it. You'll notice that normally mine goes through just fine. Completed with a green check mark. That's what we want to see. Partway through the year, Canvas changed the phrasing on this. This used to say failed with this red exclamation point, but now it says completed. And if you see that, you might think, oh, it worked. It's fine. But really, it didn't. If you see the red exclamation point, even though it says completed, it did not update your grades. So we want to actually click on this word completed, and that will show me what went wrong. This is the most common error that happens. So this means that you have a grading category that is not one of the ones that is allowed in Skyward. You, in my case, I have a category called not a group because I set it up specifically for this purpose. It's not classwork, formative homework, lab, participation, quiz, summative, or test. Those are the only categories we can use. So if it's in any other category, it's going to fail. Most commonly, it's you have one on imported assignments. Because when you're transferring from course to course, pulling from a sandbox, whatever you're doing, it's going to go in the imported assignments category. And if you forget to put that in the correct grading categories, then it won't sync. So if I see this, I need to go ahead and close this out. I need to go into my assignments and I need to fix that assignment that's in the wrong category. So in this case, I have, oh, I'm on quarter one. Let me go to quarter three where we are now. So now I have scroll down and I say, oh, whoops, I've got the not a group category. I need to go ahead and fix that. And I can do that right here. I can move it to somewhere else. So I can move it to the classwork category. Boom. Now that's where I need it. And now that not a group is empty, I'm set to go. So far, so good. And now I can sync again and it'll sync correctly. Another common occurrence when you do a manual sync is you'll see this one here. Again, we have the completed with the red checkbox or the red exclamation point. When I click this one, the assignment failed to be updated because the assignment date is wrong. So if you have assignments from previous quarters that are still set to sync, then it'll fail when you try to sync because it's in the previous quarter and Canvas can't access the old information. So in this case, we need to go into assignments. I'm going to show you on mine, for example. So we're going to go back into the assignments. Notice up here I have my quarters at the top. So I want to change mine to quarter one. And I want to make sure that none of these are green. These are the option to sync. And right from the screen, I can just uncheck. Oh, I've got one. There it is. Uncheck that. Same thing. I want to check quarter two. Or none of these are green. Any? Make sure all of them are black. And then I'm good. When quarter four starts, I'll need to do the same thing with quarter three. I'll have to come in here and uncheck all these so that they don't sync. Those are the most common sync errors that you're going to deal with. If you see something different, let me know. I'd love to take a look at it and see what's going on. You can always email me at bradley.streffler at ocps.net. Um, and if you have any other issues, please let me know and keep an eye on the channel for more videos coming out soon. Have a great day.